Hello friends, welcome to my channel Code Blocks. In this video, I try to implement one more arithmetic expression and that is infix to prefix expression. In the earlier video, I told you how to convert infix to prefix and you can see the video link in the description. Okay, so let's try to implement. So this is the main method and we have to uh, take the user input using scanner. And now take a string, string in fix. Uh, is equal to okay, is equal to sc dot next line. Okay. And after that, uh, our first step is to uh, in the earlier video I told you the first step. First of all, we have to reverse uh, the input string. Okay. Uh, so we have to create another screen string str that store the reverse tree we have to create another method that is reverse and we have to pass the infix as a parameter our first task is to reverse the input string okay and now in the second and in the second step uh, we have to convert uh, now nah, we have no no in the second step we have to re, uh, we have to correct the syntax uh, syntax of the bracket okay and the method uh, returns uh, and the integer and uh, returns the string and we have to store the string bracket and we have to correct the create another function that uh, correct the syntax of the bracket and passes the str as a parameter here okay and now uh, number three now after uh, after correcting the syntax of the bracket uh, we have to uh, convert we have to perform uh, infix to post fix expression okay so create another string that store the result post fix and create function infix post fix and uh, give the parameter str underscore bracket as an parameter and now after and the last step uh, we have to uh, again we have to reverse the resulting um, string that means the uh, post fix expression we have to again uh, reverse the post fix expression and uh, to store them uh, we have to create another uh, string that is prefix and we have to again reverse the input string that means the resulting string that means they are uh, post fix and this will print the output in fix So in the earlier video, I told you how to convert, how to implement infix to postfix. I'm just copy the code and paste here. Okay. So this is the code uh, for infix to postfix, and now we have to create uh, fu the function of reverse. Okay. Static string. It returns string. Okay. So that's why the return table has a string and the function reverse and if the parameter this is string string str and now we have to create another string uh, to to store the reverse string okay 
now we have to traverse the string from from back end when that means from last when integer i is equal to str dot length And we after after storing it, uh, storing the reverse string, we have to return the string. Okay. So this is the method uh, of re reversing the string, and we have to create another function uh, for um, for correcting the syntax of the bracket. Okay. String. It, it, this method also returning a string. Uh, method is bracket. Okay. And we have to take. And now first of all our task is to how to sin, sin, correct the syntax of the uh, bracket okay so to correct this we have to first of all we have to create convert the string to a character array okay so character array character in fix that store the character array okay str dot uh, to convert the string to character we have a, a string dot to character array this function using this function we can convert the string to uh, array and now we have to traverse the array integer i is equal to 0 i less than in 6 dot length i plus plus and if we found that in fix of i double equals to oh, open bracket okay if we, if the if the uh, string element uh, traversing the string element if we if it found that open bracket we have then we have to convert it to closing bracket okay we have to convert it as a closing bracket and if we found that in fix of i as an uh, closing bracket then we have to convert it as a open bracket if we if we found as a closing bracket then we, then we have to convert it to the uh, open bracket uh, closing if it uh, if the increased expression uh, we found that uh, this is an closing bracket then we have to convert it open bracket and if we found closing bracket then we have to convert it as a open bracket okay and after converting this we have to uh, again we have to convert the array to the string okay so that's why we have to create another string and we have to store the array into the we have to put all, all the string after converting we have to put all the array elements into the string okay that's why we have to traverse the array elements in fix dot length and we have to store it into the string okay and uh, after that we have to return the resulting string okay so we have completed first of all we have first task is, and is to reverse the string in the second step we have to correct the syntax of the syntax of the string brackets okay if it is closing bracket then we have to convert it as the open bracket and if we found is the open bracket then we have to convert it as a closing bracket and after that we have to perform in fix to post fix and after that we have to reverse uh, the post fix expression and that is the our prefix expression okay now check output so this is our input and so i think i have done one mistake uh, okay so we have to traverse from last two okay 
fast and again check output okay so this is our infix to prepare discussion so that's all for this video and the video in the previous video link are in the description and the solution of this code are available in the google drive link in the description box that's all for this video